Happy International Women's Day. This year we focus on digital and technology issues because we want to see women in that space. We know that the digital and technology revolution is accelerating. However, this revolution will not reach full speed or even the correct destination without the full participation of women and girls. We're seeing gender imbalances in science, in technology, in engineering and in mathematics. And if these imbalances continue, we'll see corresponding biases in innovations such as artificial intelligence and other technologies. We'll essentially be teaching our technology to discriminate and carry forward thousands of years of gender inequality. Diversity in tech teams and in the innovation cycle, and of course, in the workspace, is more important than ever. We must also remember that technology is here to serve humanity and the planet. If deployed correctly, it can help solve global crises of climate change, nature loss and pollution. Women must be central to this process. Women must be allowed full access in the workspace. Women must be equal under the law. Women must have, must have full access to education. Women are closer to local communities. They take a bigger picture view. They are more likely to articulate simple and effective solutions to environmental challenges. So on this International Women's Day, I call for more women to enter science, technology, engineering and mathematics. For more women to enter the workspace, for more women to have equal rights under the law, for more women in education, for societies to open those doors, for those in power to tear down the barriers that prevent women from having access, and for the world to empower women to use emerging technologies to improve their lives and the health of our planet.